morning folks bit of a different video today we are remodeling the entire garage here we're going to resurface the floor it's going to be beautiful a subscriber reached out to me says hey i own a small business i'd like to do your garage if you do a video i said let's do it so this is going to be an awesome video just to show you what's possible with resurfacing a floor now this isn't my house so it's a it's a rental so when i get my house maybe in like december or something like that then i'm going to redo the garage and do a full like you know something crazy i texted my horror landlord i said can we do this she said yeah I said, so anyways that's what we're doing today and uh excited to show you the results <laughs> So the crew has arrived here. We have Jeff and Johnny from Carefree Stone. They were nice enough to come out and do the garage. So we also have a full self-driving grinder that we're going to use on the garage floor. So we're gonna be showing all of that off shortly. Um, it's a bit overkill, but you know, why not just go all out if we're gonna make the video? So thank you guys for coming out. I appreciate it. Fans of the channel. You have two model wise? Uh, I had one, I'm waiting on another one. Yeah. So Model Y Nation is strong out here, but yeah, we're about to watch full self-driving on this uh, grinder. We're getting a lot of setup to do. Let's get into the video. All right, so while they're setting up, I'm gonna ask some questions because I have no idea what's going on here. But look, so this is the grinder. So this is our grinder. This is a high part vacuum. Normally this setup is is designed for more, uh, you know, warehouse, big, you know, big commercial use. Right. But we figured, why not, you know, self-driving. Yeah, Let's do show it. it all. Now, do you have to pay extra for the full self-driving on this thing? <laughs> well, yeah, one way or another, yeah, you, you do. Right. This isn't cheap. But there's no subscription fee, it just comes with the unit. Yeah. Which is kind of nice, because Tesla, you know, they like to, uh, it's an extra 10, and then you don't get to keep it with you, so. Yeah, they this do sell, They do sell the, the, the non-remote control version, but okay. uh, we went all out. Yeah, no, this is cool to, how the, like, straps around your shoulder and everything. But. Now, if you guys are looking to get your garage floor done or something like that, I will have all of their information down in the description below. Nice of them to come out, they're supporters of the channel. And then to do this for me, just for trading off making a video and giving them some exposure, I thought that was a really nice gesture. So all of their information is down in the description below. Check them out. out now um, so Jeff what's going on right now is that just some epoxy or yeah we're running uh, we're running caulking in the bottom of the joints because the joints crack so it gives it a nice clean look when you put the epoxy and flake over it so the cracks don't show through and okay. it also waterproofs it as well oh sweet if I spray like tire shine or clean my wheels or something in the garage the, the floor finish will be safe yeah so what we do um, when we clear coat it we use a polyaspartic which is completely it's one of the best clear coats you can put on. It's very uh, chemical resistant as okay. far as all that stuff goes. Cool.
we're currently making it rain in here, but wanted to kind of give you guys uh, a little insight as to what's going on and Jeff can kind of go in this a little bit more. So we've already ground it down. Epoxy base coat. Yep, the epoxy base coat's down. Now we're putting the flake in, which are just paint chips. And what were you just saying off camera? We were just talking about the polyaspartic finish. That so, you use. some people will do an epoxy base coat or epoxy clear coat. Uh, epoxy by nature will amber. So if you if you use epoxy as a clear coat, you're going to have a yellow garage in six months. So we we put a polyaspartic clear coat, which is going to stay brilliant white and is way more chemical resistant than epoxy. Yeah. And then after this, so tomorrow morning, you'll sand it. So after we'll sit, after this cures, sand it down and put down the clear coat. Sweet. Yeah, it looks amazing already. Well, folks, it's Sunday morning. I'm gonna put the final touches on the garage. Cars had to sit outside overnight. But I gotta say the attention to detail that these guys did like within the garage, just getting, making sure every corner was sanded down and then making sure all the coverage and just doing everything correctly and then using the more expensive materials to make sure it lasts for the lifetime of the garage. Really impressive, I highly recommend them. Um, it's gonna look amazing once I have the final touches, plus being able to shoot video in the garage Everything's going to be a little more clean. So thank you to them. And all of their information is down in the description below. So tell them Jeeb sent you. And send me pictures of your guys' garage because I'm pumped to uh, see what else they do. So as of right now, the garage looks like it's done. We're about to sand it and then put the finish on. So after you put the finish on, how long until we can, you can park a car on it? You're going to want to wait 72 hours. Okay. Um, especially if the main thing is hot tires, you know, being on the road and coming in. If you want to uh, really okay. cure out, you can walk on it the next day, though. If you come up close to kind of see it, it's, it's got like some rough finish to it after it's sanded and everything. It's going to be totally different. portion of the project here. So what are we mixing together? Or is this, so this a secret is a, formula? This is a secret formula. All right. This is our two part urethane clear coat. This is chemical resistant. It's gonna, it's gonna keep uh, you know any oil drips, anything like that, protect the driveway from staining, all that. And you said you can't drink this, right? It's not recommended. It's not recommended, okay. process is all complete. Again, thank you to Jeff and Johnny for coming out and do it, doing this. The work looks amazing. I'll have their Instagram link down in the description below. And I'm also going to have their website and everything, contact info. So if you want to book something with them, you can get it set up through there. But it looks incredible. And I just have to let it sit for, what, 72 hours now? 24 hours before foot traffic, 72 okay. hours before putting a car on it. Okay, cool. And I'm just going to leave the let the garage breathe for today and then close it up tonight and uh, we'll be good to go. But yeah, the work is unbelievable. And like I said, the attention to detail, I mean, I was sitting out here just with them filming what I could the whole time and even like covering little things like under this piece of metal here and under the hot water tank, everything was co covered precisely. And it's just uh, really good work they do. So I always like to recommend high quality products. Anything I'm putting on my car, it's gonna be like an OEM plus, and then that just extends into other parts of my life, like the garage. So the work they did is amazing. Um, and then support these guys, local business, and they've been in business for 17 years. They're not rookies, they know what they're doing. So thank you guys, and um, I'll see you guys in the next video.